What's up guys, Victor here. Good morning, it's a beautiful day. I'm out here with Brooke, I'm out here with Darcy, and I'm out here with Brian. We are on the Darcyzzle offshore. We're gonna head offshore today. It's gonna be a good day, so stay tuned. Don't tune out. First order of business, we're gonna try to catch a giant AJ, and last time we were on Darcy's boat, we got our asses handed to us, but yeah. Brian brought was uh, generous enough to bring his 50 white out here and we got a 100 pound braid on the bent butt. We're gonna drop down those live gogs on the wreck, so hopefully we'll get it done. We're just getting you on real fast, right? Okay. There's some sea monsters down there. He's getting eaten. He's on, he's on, he's on. Oh, wait. Yeah, he's getting eaten. Check this out, check this out. Nice. Oh, we're on. You on? Oh, yeah. you got a fish. Oh. Oh. Nice, get him up. Go, 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 go. Dig it. Oh, oh. no, he's, he's on. Just trying to pull, but he can't. <laughs> you alright? Got it? Yeah. It's an AJ. Not a bad size one. Nice. We don't need it. I'll just grab it. Right here. First fish of the day. There's the first stage. Oh. No gap needed. We got him. This is a greater amberjack right here. He's big. Right exactly yeah, it's 28, 28 to the fork, right? Exactly at 28. A little over. Yeah, he's good. <laughs> uh, yeah, just like. Oh, you're gonna, no. you're getting eaten. You're getting. Oh, 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 oh! Crank, 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 crank! Wait, wait. He's not there yet. No, he's messing with it. Yeah, he is. Big wave coming. Oh yeah, oh, you're on. Oh, you're on. Oh, oh. Oh. Uh. Come on! What is he doing? No, I think you're on. You're on. Yeah, you're on, you're on, you're on. Keep going. Oh, oh, go, 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 go. Low gear, low gear, low gear. Low gear. Oh! He's down. Yeah. Nice. Go. He's a little short. He's, a, he's fatty. He's actually, honestly, that's an Alamico right there. That's a giant. How high is dorsal fin yes. right there? That's an Alamico. Okay. Those are actually good to eat. Yeah. So Darcy just caught this one, and this one I'm pretty sure it's well. I'm not pretty sure it's an Almaco Jack. You guys can tell the dorsal fin on this one right here is really tall, and if you notice that the body of this Jack is a lot more broader. It's all a lot. It's tall. It's up and down, and Almacos don't have a limit or size regulation. So we're gonna keep this one and kill it for food because they actually taste really good. But we'll show you at the end of the video the difference between this one and the greater amberjack that we caught earlier, but yeah. he fought good, didn't he? Yeah, this thing put up one heck of a fight. And these, they're just strong fighters all around. He fought all the way to the surface. Mm -hmm. So uh, we're, let's get another one. We're two for two. Brooke's next. Yeah. <laughs> we have not broken off once yet. Yes. So Brooke is dropping down the third gog. We are two for two. I am so stoked when a plan comes together. We wanted to go wreck fishing and we're doing it. And we are two for two, no break offs. And we got the targeted species. Go, up. Brooke, go, Brooke. Get him, babe. Right, watch that engine. Watch that engine. Uh -oh. oh no. Oh, this is a real one. This is a real one. Did he just get eaten by a shark? Uh -oh. oh, I think he got eaten by a shark. Yeah. Got a big fish on here on the bottom. It either got eaten by a shark or she's got a big fish on or bottom. All right, we just broke off either on a shark or on the wreck. I think that the fish took us into the wreck. Round four. Redemption round. Tosh point o redemption time. Can she do it? What's your answer, Brooke? <laughs> I think I can. Come on, the people want to know. I think I can. I think. Are you on bottom? Or are you getting eaten? Oh, you're getting eaten. You're on. You're on. on. Real real. Well, I think. Oh yeah, you got. Fish. Yeah, you do. Oh, yeah, you do. Fish. Ain't low gear. Oh. There you go. Or are you there on you bottom? Go. Oh, we are on bottom. Up, up, bring him up. Go, go, go. <laughs> Darcy was dropping a jig while we broke off. Well, Brooks fish broke off, so I think she's got a nice one. How did I land on that? That's like why that? it was so hard because you yeah. did Holy crap! Almaco? Almaco. Another Almaco. I just got like, thank you. I just got like double the workout because this fish came in upside down. <laughs> I ripped a huge gash in him. I can't believe he came up. Drop it down a little bit. Oh, 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 oh Brick's on. Fish Brick's on. on. Get him, babe. Oh, boy. oh, we got him. That tip is shaking violently. Yes. I love it. So Brick's got it. That's a two speed reel, and Brooks got it in low gear. So when you have a low gear, you have more power and torque, and you just winch them in. If you have it in high gear, it's good when you're trying to catch up the fish, but not when you're trying to horse them up. 
Okay, babe. Mary's 27. All right, so I had three attempts. I finally got a fish to the boat. This is a greater amberjack, you can tell, because his top fin isn't as tall as the amakos. We've caught two amakos, and this is the second greater amberjack. They have to be 28 inches to the fork. This one's 27, so we gotta let him go. Let this guy go to grow a little bigger. There he goes. That's a little big son. Woo! Get him up. Nice. Oh, he's trying to grow. Oh, 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 oh. These things throw down pound for pound more than any fish out there. Yeah. I love amberjack fishing. Yeah, so that's our third grader, fourth grader amberjack. Yeah. We at least one, keep two, so we'll see if this guy's keeper. Whew. But nice fish, we're killing it today. Measure him, Vic. Shout out to everyone who wished me luck and uh, commented below when I said I'm going AJ fishing today. Thank you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, we're gonna let him go because he was short. That was so fast. That was fast. That was so fast. Was like, boom. You didn't even make it to the mono, did you? <laughs> oh, there oh, we, we go. Oh. oh, that's not a little one. Shark, there you go. Oh. Crank, big crank. Oh, man. Oh, oh we yeah. got a real one. Yeah. Dude, you got a big fish. You got the rest? Getting off the rest now. Good. Did we? Yeah. Oh, oh man. Oh, I think oh, you still that have That was your... a real one. That was the biggest one of the day. To put that into perspective for you guys, we're probably fishing like 35 pounds of drag and Ryan has it going like probably eight knots away from the wreck and the AJ is just ripping drag the other way. Yeah. But I think we're going to see what happened to our rig, but I, we got our rig back. I think the hook might have just pulled or broke. Yeah. What happened was when we put that much pressure on these fish, the hook just pulled. It just ripped right out of its mouth, but... Oh, that's oh. another real one. Nice, you got a big fish. Ooh! Come on, get up, get up, get crank, up. Crank, big crank, 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 crank. Go, go, go. Oh, oh my god. Oh, it's a grouper. Oh, oh, oh my it's god. a giant it's black a grouper. grouper. Oh, oh grab it, grab it, grab it. Get the pricker. pricker. Slow down, slow down, get the pricker. Pricker, pricker. Slow down. Oh, Holy god. Oh. Oh. Is no it, is it way! Is no. it season? No! It's oh a, my god! Oh, it's a giant black grouper, ah! but it's out of season! Ah! Oh it's man! It's insane right now! This Ooh. is like a 20 pound black grouper! Nice! Holy shit! I can't believe it! I Ooh. cannot believe that! Wow! Oh my gosh, alright. You have the venting tool. I am really sad. You guys, it is not black, it is not season. Grouper's closed right now, but it has every bit of 20, 25 pound black grouper. Incredible. A beautiful fish on a live gog. Incredible. It is so sad it is not season. We gotta let this guy go. Grouper season is closed, but that is a monster. And very happy we caught him. And he went straight back down. Didn't need the venting tool at all. He swam straight down. Awesome work, guys. Nice job. So sick. sick. You never know what you're gonna get dropping a live gog on a wreck. We thought that the fish we lost before might have been an even bigger black grouper. You don't know. My heart is racing. That was a good fish, especially for out here. That's a that's like a Keys dry tortugas fish. You don't see many of those fish yeah. around here, definitely. Barrier. Huge shout out and thank you to Brian and Darcy for taking us out. We got on some fish. Yeah. And I am very happy. And if you guys don't know Darcy, which you probably already do because <laughs> she's huge, but make sure to check out her her channel. It will be in the description box below. Her and Brian do a great job, and we're very thankful that they took us out. And also, don't forget, Babe has a YouTube channel too. I know you guys probably already seen it, but definitely subscribe to her. And she's killing it with the catch and cook videos, but one thing I want to say is, I can't believe it's not grouper season! Yes, yeah. I know! I, I felt so, it felt so crazy releasing a fish that you like dream of catching, and it was such yeah. a big black grouper, but... Yeah. 
It was, guys, it was a strong release too. It was awesome to see that fish swim oh, he away shot too. Down. We that didn't was need awesome. a venting tool or anything. Yeah, that was awesome. I also just want to chime in really quick. I want to give them a big special thank you, not only for them coming on our boat, but they brought us all live fresh goggle eyes. <laughs> so that's like totally awesome. They put all the hard work in this morning and got up at like 4 a.m. So these guys are like hardcore fishermen. Just FYI, if you mm. didn't know that already. So if you guys made it to the very end of this video, I want you to comment below. It's a black grouper, baby. Comment below. <laughs>